Next, your stance is wrong too. Your feet need to be shoulder width apart. Okay, so I was standing with my feet like close together, so I fell over maybe? All right. Now stick out that cute little butt and hold your arms forward. Um. Okay. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to Yes Guy Game, and we're back playing Sweet Volleyball High. And if you haven't seen the last episode, check it, link in the description. This is a game, a visual novel, about a girl who plays on a volleyball team. So, in my quest to unlock and play all the volleyball games, maybe not all of them, one of the, the fun ones, I've stumbled across this. Um, last episode, we learned that, well, Check it out if you haven't. Spoiler alert. We learned that our one of our star players got in a car crash and was in a coma. And that means that we, our character, Aya, now has to play on the starting lineup of our school volleyball team. So you know, it's bittersweet, but mostly sweet, because we're going to get started. Anyways, thank you guys for the support you've shown to this channel, to this to this series. Uh, thank you for everybody who watched. Episode number one, if you haven't checked it out, link in the description if you haven't already. Hit that subscribe button. You guys have been a huge help in helping me to get spread, you know, get this channel to be as, as best as it possibly can and hopefully inspire other people to make to do what they love and make it the best thing that they can. I love volleyball and I love video games, so I mean it's taken me to this point. I'm at sweet volleyball high. My love of volleyball and video games has taken me here. That's not inspiring, I don't know what is. That's probably not that inspiring, actually. Anyways, that's the goal. Thank you guys for helping out so much. The subscribes, the, the, the nice messages, the likes, everything means a lot to me, so thank you guys so much. Anyways, enough chatter. Stay focused. Let's get to it. All right, so I've arrived home after being told that I've got to start on the volleyball team. Is mom home? Mom, hey mom. Yeah, that's my mom, in case you didn't see the other episode. Yeah, she looks like she could be, like... I'm not even gonna go there. Turns out I will be playing volleyball after all. Yes! I is so disappointed about that. But yes, guy is fired up. Does that mean I... Mom's gonna come to a game, Aya! Your mother's gonna come watch you play. No, Mom... Aya! Listen, no. What? No, yeah, Mom needs to come to the game. It's a necessity. Look at all you guys out there, you know what it's like having your mom or dad come to a game, probably. If you don't, apologize. Uh, I apologize. And totally embarrass you in front of everybody there. Go, yeah, yes, go, yeah, go! Well, yeah, okay. So my mom is suggesting that I go hang out with my grandfather out in the country. I'm not really sure why the story is taking this direction, but Aya seems interested in going to hang with grandpa. Maybe he's a volleyball guru. Who's going to teach me, teach me some tips and tricks for that perfect platform, that butter set, and to get up and pound some balls. Well, hopefully, yeah, okay. So it's just skipped us ahead to, like, the end of school the next day. So Ebi Harasan walks into class. It's the star player on the volleyball team. She's always dressed pretty plainly. She means business. She's a pro volleyball player. She's on the national team. Under 18, though. Under 18, wait, so these girls are under 18? All right, we're in the locker room for practice. A few bags of balls on the floor. All right, Yuka. I'm ready to practice and train to kick some ass. Yuka's flirting with me. Weird. I don't... Yuka, you were the one making fun of me for being on the bench all the time. Now you're being nice to me? What the heck? Hi, Yuka. Ready for tonight? Oh, yeah. I'm ready to show you what I'm made of. Don't expect too much, though. I guess I'm shite. Yuka says, oh, come on, hit the ball with your hands, get over the net, it's not that hard, you know. Yuka, you're on a volleyball team, you know there's more to the game than that, come on. It's Nanami, come on you two, we're ready to start, I'm ready to go. Captain. Oh, Nanami's the captain. Yes, captain. Aye, aye, captain. We get to the gym ourselves every time we practice, so there's no one else in the gym, perfect. Starting to get brighter during the evenings, so we don't have to turn on the lights. Perfect. I'm glad these things hurt my eyes and attract the bugs. F the bugs. I can hear the squeaking of shoes on the varnished floor as we follow Ebihara-san 
to the center of the court. We're getting ready to practice. Wait, <laughs> that was that was the voice acting line. There's a whole line and, and the voice actor just goes, okay. There's no full line. Listen, if you need a voice actor for this game to play some of the male characters, give me a call. I will do it. Okay, everyone, let's start with some passing drills. Kisuke Senpai is going to be serving for us. All right, thanks, Kisuke. Mizuki Saito, you'll join me on this side. Kazuke, you can serve back from the other side and we'll swap out. So we're doing some serve and pass. So they're going to serve to me. Perfect. Make sure to pass the ball once and then pass back over to Kazuki. Got it? Got it. Easy, right, Aya? Super easy. I'll give it a shot. All right, let's start. Three, two, one. Voice acting. Oh, God. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Yuka looks good. At least she knows what she's doing. Mizuki! Mizuki! It's just a pass, so Yuka's a good passer, I guess. Now hit it back to Yuka. Okay, I'm gonna set it back to Yuka. I screwed it up. Oops. I'm nervous. I'm just totally nervous. I've never played this sport ever, and now I gotta be good at it? Are you kidding me? You know what is important about volleyball? Size matters. Right, it's just practice. Okay, three, two, one, start. You don't need to do a three, two, one, start. It's practice. Saito. Saito. Yep. Mizuki. I can do this. Ha! Wait. Did I? What are you laughing at, Yuka? What happened? Did I screw it up again? I'm terrible. Three, two, one. Mizuki. Okay, I have to get it this time. I'm just setting the ball so she can hit it over. That's all I'm doing. Super simple. I got this. Huh? I missed the ball completely. You're kidding me. You've never actually played before? Wait, I've never actually played before? I've been on the team for years and I've never played before? Oh my God. This story. No, I've never played before. Aya confirms it. Mizuki, this isn't a joke. Some of us are depending on you, damn it. How many players are on the team? Is there only six players on the team and you need me to play? Well, I guess we played three on three the other night at practice. In the last episode, our first practice, we played three on three. I, I assumed that that, would, that meant people were rotating in. But in hindsight now, that must mean there really is only six players on the team. Damn! If you're not going to take this seriously, you shouldn't even be here. No, I'm taking this seriously. I'm just seriously shit. You're just wasting my time and everyone else's time. No, I'm doing my best, Nanami. I'm really trying. I want to be a star. I'm going to make that junior national team. This obviously isn't working. Look, let's call it a day and try again tomorrow. I'm done with this. What? We've only been practicing for five minutes. I tried to set it like three times. What? We're done? You're pissed with me, Nanami? Come on! Whoa. Aya, you made her pretty mad. I've never seen her like that before. Listen, Yuka. I don't need any of your sass. It's been a rough day. She's got a stick up her butt. Don't worry about it. Does she mean literally or... Okay, we're... Yeah. Stupid question. Look. Why don't I give you a couple pointers before we go, huh? Perfect! Now somebody's making actual sense, Yuka. Then we can get out of here. So firstly, you're positioning your hands all wrong. Okay, good to know. I was probably holding them like this, trying to volley it. <laughs> Hold them together like this. That way, you're ready to bump. Oh, I was just trying to bump, so I was probably like, nah. we've all seen that guy or girl in the gym who's trying to... <laughs> that was me. But now, okay, hands together, perfect platform. Do you see that? Look at how level that is. That is perfect. Look at that. Comment down below, do you go hand over hand and thumbs in, or do you go fist in hand? Or do you do some weird stuff like this? Let me know in the comments below. Next, your stance is wrong too. Your feet need to be shoulder width apart. Okay, so I was standing with my feet like close together, so I fell over maybe? All right. Now stick out that cute little butt and hold your arms forward. Um. Okay. <laughs> Great. Okay. Now I'm going to pass the ball to you gently. Don't try and hit it hard. Just try and direct it back toward me. You got it. I'm sticking my cute little butt out. 
the speed of the ball will do most of the work, okay? All right. See? That wasn't bad at all. Yes! My first bump ever! What game? Do you get to relive your first bump ever? Yuka, thank you so much. That's sarcasm. This is bullshit. Tomorrow, just keep doing that, okay? You got it, Yuka. I don't need your sass. Oh, it's nothing. <laughs> How about we hit the showers, huh? Um, I don't know about you, but like, yeah, we hit the showers after practice, but I never had one of my teammates go, Hey, let's hit the showers, huh? That's pretty inappropriate, teammate. Yuka! Then we can hit the town. What? We're going out? Now? I mean, I'm down, but like, that's kind of random. We're hitting the town. Oh, hey, look over there. All right, so I'm out on the town with Yuka after practice. And yeah, she, I don't know, where are we? Yeah, so we're downtown Tokyo. Pretty cool, I mean, that's awesome, but I don't know what we're doing. Wait, they let you into bars? Okay, great, let's get hammered. Cigarette. Oh, right, Yuka's cool, I forgot. Yuka's the cool girl, she smokes, she gets in trouble all the time. What was the other thing? Probably something else to do with her being in trouble. Super cool. I do not smoke. Yeah, no smokes, we're playing volleyball. So Yuka is telling me that she goes into these bars and she gets guys to buy her drinks. Look at the name of this bar. It's right there. Look at that. It's called Bang On. Really? What are some of the other English words going on here? Fresh. <laughs> so Yuka, she, but she says something pretty interesting. She says, not that I ever have any interest in them, but hey, free is free. So you're not interested in men or just these men? I'm confused. So she's saying I should show a little cleavage to the barman and they'll let me in the bar. Well, I mean, I I don't know. Should I do that? So I'm bailing. Yeah, Aya, Aya is bailing. She's like, no, forget that. I'm not doing that. That's a joke. We gotta focus on volleyball. That's a bummer. But you have to come out another night, okay? I kind of get off on corrupting cute, innocent girls like you. Ha ha ha. Yuka! What are you saying right now? What? All right, so I made it back home to the beautiful, so beautiful, guitar music. Sunset is beginning. Mom's welcoming me home. It's perfect. So my mom bought me a ticket to go see Granddad out in the country. It's kind of weird timing because like, the volleyball thing is very real happening right now, but now why am I gonna take some time to go see Granddad when I gotta be training? I really don't understand. All right, so I'm in the classroom and it's frantic with activity day. I don't, don't really know what that means, but it's exam day. Ah, last minute cramming. <laughs> hey, I am no stranger to last minute cramming. Aya, ah, I mean Yuka, been studying hard, huh? You know it. Yuka is is showing some interest in me. We we uh, nobody showed interest in me before, but now that I'm a starter on the volleyball team. Yuka seems to be having interest in me. What? I don't like that. Why weren't you into me before, Yuka? Nanami canceled practice for the rest of the season? <laughs> Wait, what? Yeah, what? Still pissed about what happens. She canceled the last match, too? Nanami, are you stupid, Nanami? What are you talking about? I mean, okay, I guess it is understandable one of the top players is in a coma. I mean, that's a pretty big deal. But also, what? So no big deal. So Yuka's saying I'll leave the volleyball club. I hadn't thought about it. No, I'm staying in the volleyball club. I'm not sure. No, it's called Sweet Volley High. I'm staying in that volleyball club. Break the news to anatomy. What? Oh, Yuka's after my spot. There's our principal. Thanks, miss. Settle down, please. Yep, thank you. Why does the principal teach every class? English. Charlie doesn't have as much hair as he used to. He's got a receding hairline at the front, and it's bald on top. Thinning. Come on, I was close. I'd be failing this exam. So I'm going to spend the entire summer in the countryside with Grandpa? It's kind of weird. I mean, 
Not the grand, not, nothing against grandpas, but like, I, I, why? I don't get it. Is something exciting gonna happen there? An ice cream store? Is there one there? I don't know. Pencils down. Thanks, principal. Great. Summer break. So I'm done exams. I'm done school. Is this grade? What grade is this? Who knows? I'm asking Yuka if she's got any plans. All right. She's the B. All right. I'm done. Forget this garbage. Oh, Yuka's invited. For no, don't forget this garbage. Yuka's inviting me to the beach. I'm not necessarily against that. I mean, I know we're here for the volleyball, but I mean beach volleyball. It's a thing, you guys. Oh, but I'm saying that sounds nice, but I have to go and spend time with my grandpa. Old people, huh? Boring. <laughs> yeah, I bought the ticket. Okay, see ya, Yuka. What? Okay, so I hop on the train, and now I'm entering the country to meet up with my grandpa. I don't know why, I'm really hoping that Grandpa is like some sort of volleyball guru and he's going to teach me how to be the best player ever. Let's check. Oh, Grandpa! There you are! Aya-chan, it's you! Yeah, it's me, Grandpa! Is he giving me the Vulcan, like, live long and prosper? Like, hi, hi Grandpa! Good to see you, too! Aya goes, Grandpa, why are you here? And he goes, I live here. Well, <laughs> okay. I mean, why are you at home, Grandpa? Well, you come and find me. That's perfect. This guy, I like this guy already. Oh, Grandpa, you're being real nice, calling me beautiful. You both get it from me, of course. <laughs> oh, that's how I picture him saying that. <laughs> right. Is I a bit creeped out by Grandpa? Hey, I was quite a looker back in the day. I bet you were, Grandpa. You look like shit now, though. How do you think I managed to land a cute lady like your grandma? Oh, <laughs> and that creepy laugh, Grandpa. You better be good at volleyball. I'll be. Uh, this will be weird. Okay, Grandpa's asking how I'm doing. Yeah, I'm fine, thanks, Grandpa. You had a pretty good na nap. You stretch your legs down to the farm to the road to get some eggs. All right. Well, suit suit yourself. Oh. <laughs> Grandpa is a creep. But if he's a good volleyball guy, I may put up with it. I don't know. We'll see. So there's some old books in the house. One of them is called Falling in Love with Your Boss. Grandma had some pretty interesting reading choices. She's passed away, though. Sometimes, okay, yeah, absolute trash. Aya is not into that garbage. I'm with you, Aya. Romance novels? Who would read or play through a romance novel or a, a visual novel game? Only losers would play through that shit. Right. I found a book from the 1964 Tokyo Olympics. Judo? Who did judo? Not grandma. <laughs> you found my old medal, huh? You are creepy as fuck, Grandpa, really. Grandpa, is this yours? So I found a medal. He's told me about it a million times, apparently. Grandpa, who? I don't even know you. It's been a long time, Grandpa. Yeah, like, come on. Okay, so what happened, Grandpa? You won for judo. The, dang it! That doesn't help me with volleyball. Middleweight, great. Popular sport, who cares? Tournaments, medal, judo in Japan, great. Peak, Olympic, yep, great. What about the volleyball? Wait, Aya's saying she'd love to try do do judo with this creepy grandpa who goes, oh. <laughs> Maybe you could be my personal coach. If it was volleyball, Aya, you're on the volleyball team. Really? Judo isn't what it used to be. Not popular anymore. You get injured all the time. That's right. Coach me in volleyball, Grandpa. At the pro level, there's not really any way to make a living outside of coaching. Well, if you're serious about sports, I choose something else. Like volleyball, I've chosen volleyball. Wait a minute. Don't you play volleyball at school? Yes, I do, Grandpa. That might be pushing it. I'm part of the club, but I'm no good. You're right. I'm pretty shit. I only learned to bump yesterday. But look at my platform. It's sick. Well, you know, the 18, 1964 Olympic judo wasn't the only sport introduced. So the first year of volleyball was in the Olympics? 1964 in Tokyo, the first time volleyball was in the Olympics. Naturally, the women's team won gold. So Japan, the women's team won gold that year. There's a fun fact. The more you know.
Okay, he, this is a creepy statement by Grandpa. He goes, oh, I used to know some of the players. A fun bunch they were. <laughs> Grandpa, really? So why don't you try getting good at volleyball? Grandpa is encouraging my volleyball skill. I wouldn't know where to start. I'm no good at all. I'm not particularly fit. I don't have good technique. I don't even know the basics. Well, technique comes with time and practice. That's the easy part. What? Grandpa, are you going to help me? I can't teach you that, but... Stand up a moment. Grandpa, this is getting weird. Why am I standing up? What do you what do you mean? What do you mean yes sitting at me, Grandpa? You're tall, that's good. Okay, check. Cause you know what? Size matters. <laughs> you got good posture, that's good. You're damn right. But hey, why did you poke me? Where did he poke me? You're soft, Aya Chan. Really, Grandpa? Really? You're gonna poke me and call me soft? Wow. You need more muscle, you've gotta be strong, yet fast. Yeah, thanks. I think that would solve your problem. No, my problem is, is I've never played the game in the F Sport. I just learned this perfect platform yesterday. Are you kidding me? Gym, bah, you don't need a gym. Why not? Let old Gramps show you how to do it. Grandpa's gonna train the shit out of me. And I'm gonna come back and be super fit, strong, ready to take, kick some ass. Okay guys, well that's where I'm gonna end this episode. We've, uh, yeah, we've, we've journeyed out to the countryside to be with Grandpa. Grandpa's going to train me physically to be better at volleyball without actually touching a volleyball. Listen, you and I both know that to be good at volleyball, you need to actually play volleyball. Like, you can't... Like, I mean, if you're physical, it helps, yes. But you need the skills. Like, are you kidding me, Grandpa? Well, I don't know. We'll see what happens. Um, anyways, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this episode. If you did, hit that like button. Maybe leave a comment with some of your thoughts. Um, some of your thoughts on what the heck's going on with Aya and Grandpa. Is Grandpa creepy? I think he is. Is he though? I don't know. Maybe. Let me know in the comments below. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Would really, really appreciate that. Trying to make this channel the best it possibly can be. And grow the community of like-minded people like me who love volleyball, who enjoy video games, and just love having fun and, and, being, and having the most fun we can while in the time that we have. So... Thank you guys so much for watching, and we hope to see you next time on Yes Guy Gaming.